What a dork. I still really like him though. He's a really good comedian. I think the only person that can say nothing and be epic. Well, good morning or good night. Doesn't really matter what time zone we're in. It's always morning somewhere. Or, wow, that's coincidental. Let's see what it is. It's Twitter. Hey guys, good morning. I'm on my way to Toledo to shoot the first section of my Ford Fiesta Movement July mission, which is themed gaming. And this doesn't only include video gaming or console gaming or whatever. This is also like other games, old school games. What would you have done in the 50s? I think, for example, going bowling was very popular. So our thing is bowling. We had a great idea for LA, which one doesn't work out time-wise and second, Euro is not here, but we will still make it work. I'm pretty sure we can. So I'm meeting up with Andy and then we're going to bowling alley and I hope the weather is good because I want to do a couple of outside shots. Oh, dead animal. And yeah, inside the bowling alley, I hope they let us shoot. Sometimes, well, so far, everything went well. I hope it works out. <laughs> I got about two hours drive and it's a good start to get into driving because next week I will be driving like 10 hours a day or so. That's gonna be interesting. <laughs> I'm trying to upload the vlog because we were a little bit behind. Uh, Sarah edited the last one, I think. So uh, we'll be uh, up and back on track again. And I was like, why not start vlogging? I mean, I'm, I'm doing stuff. Well, anyways, uh, let's start today off with something really cool, really interesting. A while back, like I think two years even, I made a video on my Dutch channel called uh, Koken met Jutta, basically translated cooking with Jutta. And I want to do that again. Uh, you remember that Sarah and I love burgers. Well, I love the burgers when she makes them. I don't really make burgers myself most of the times, but today I was like, dude, I'm hungry. It is like 4.30am 4, 4 in the morning. Why not make a burger? So I'm gonna teach you guys how to make a burger. It's really, really simple. It's not uh, super complicated. We're going step by step. And once we're done, you'll have an awesome burger that you can eat and your stomach will feel moderately good. <laughs> hey, Jay, Jay, Jay. Oui. Come on, be a good dog. Sit. 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 No, that's my bag. She normally sits when I say sit. No? We'll go. Let's go. Let's go. That way. Okay. The door doesn't open. <laughs> Thank you. That's no problem. Excuse me. Ah! Ah! I'm not well. Ah! Help! Help! I'm destroying everything. Sorry. Making burgers is not really that hard. You can do it by cooking them in a pan. You can get a barbecue and do it. I personally love the barbecue, but sometimes you can just use a little oven. They do pretty much the same kind of thing as the grill does, more or less. Well, since we don't have a lot of time to actually prepare it and. It's kind of boring. I pretty much prepared everything already. Um, I know it takes sort of the thing away from the tutorial, but uh, that doesn't mind. So first of all, um, you usually have you have like different settings on there. You have the top, bottom, and uh, other things, uh, and both of them on. Sorry. And uh, I usually go for around eight to ten minutes. You can preheat it. That's perfectly fine, depending on what kind of thing you have. And then pretty much the, the next step is to put the buns in with a burger and have them cooked together so you have sort of a rich flavor taste going on. Um, the burger of course needs to go longer than the buns, that's not that weird. So um, let's do that. I prepared the package already. I don't really like the cheese that much. Uh, if you do, you can leave it on, it's perfectly fine. I tend to just throw it away, put the burger in, buns in, and in eight minutes we have a burger. You thought it was real. For those who have seen the video, probably already knew it before I actually did it. Activated this creative source. Let's see what comes out. Yes. He's going to VidCon, by the way. So we'll see him again. <laughs> oh my goodness, you're sitting here vlogging and I thought you were just talking to yourself. I should know better than that. I just was wondering, <laughs> why would I talk to myself? Like, out loud. <laughs> <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> She's so weird. She's like I've never been with you before. No. You've never really vlogged, huh? 
I, I get so lazy about vlogging, I just can't do it. Yeah. Hey, hey. It doesn't now offend again. <laughs> <laughs> every, every time I'm on the road with him, we see an elephant and him, so I obviously have to take a photo and post it on Instagram later. And we just walked in there and they just said, yeah, whatever, take the lane over there, that's fine. This is no problem at all, so. By the way, 32 is my lucky number and that's our lane number, so ah, you're in perfect. trouble now. <laughs> Uh-oh, now I'm scared. <laughs> Go ahead. What? I, I need to push enter. Yeah, pu push. Bam. Bam. TL, that's all I get. Really? TL, the line. TL. That was so anticlimactic. I typed out the line and I get TL. Yeah. Nice. Hey, that's the kind of car you have. TL. Back here at TL, isn't that what it is? The old one. <laughs> and and Bam. 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 So uh, TL plays against TN. <laughs> Good job. When all names are entered, press bowl. No, not yet. No. We're no, we're waiting. No we're not ready yet. Start as one bowl. No. We have extra light here. I was clever enough to pack it, but we had like 10 minutes of... Yeah, that's okay. <laughs> of, of random trying to put in the batteries. It didn't turn on, but now it does. So, that's good. <laughs> I guess today is one of those days where you don't see any kind of sunlight. <laughs> well, you don't see any sunlight. Neither do I. I uh, fell asleep in the morning. And uh, I woke up just before it went dark. Nice. It doesn't really matter as long as you're awake, right? Sarah was going to Toledo today and I'm kind of excited because she was supposed to be shooting her, at least a part of the mission video. I'm kind of also sad because that was supposed to be with me. I, I keep moping to myself every time. Mostly because I have no control over it. And that's the that's the hardest part, that I cannot can do anything really to change the fact that I'm not there right now. That decision has been made by someone else or someone's <laughs> else. And from here on out, it's gonna be a hell of a lot more difficult to get everything like we wanted to have. Yeah, I don't know. I just try to uh, stay positive, I guess. <laughs> no worries. We'll. Uh, or figure something out and I'm really happy with all the support and all the tweets and comments saying that you guys are fighting for us in at least spirit uh, there's not much else you can do I think unless there is something else that you can really do we'll let you know other than that I'm really happy that you guys are there for us it, it really helps us to stay positive and stay focused I like it it's, it's a good feeling that we get from it Oh. It's not good at all. <laughs> it has air conditioning too. <laughs> oh my god. There's a little AC on there. And he was like, what's that? And I'm like, that's air conditioning. Yes, no, uh. Do you turn the camera on? Not the camera. I'm sorry. Well, apparently we suck when we turn on the camera. And we, if we don't film, we are pretty awesome. Wrapping everything up. Well, you're done already. It's easy. Yeah. Here, vlog, talk to the people. Talk to the camera, like, say what? Well, it was a thoroughly enjoying, enjoy, enjoyable experience. <laughs> um, Sarah beat me one time by about 50. I beat her once by maybe five. And after that, I have no idea what the score was because we were too busy creating shots, like the potty shot. If you're familiar with that, comment below about your favorite potty shot moment. But actually we had one strike with the potty shot, I think, right? Yes, there was one, at least one strike, and I think you had a spare as well with the potty shot. That's impressive. Maybe we should just use that. And then, and then it flashed on the board, and then it flashed on the board with the whole, then it flashed on the board with the whole, the Nerdist thing, which was kind of nice. But it didn't even say the Nerdist on the board unless you got... The Nerdish, yeah. yeah. I gotta pronounce my, my sound script. It didn't even say the Nerdist. <laughs> Nerdish. It didn't even say the nerdish. It didn't even say the nerdish up on the board unless you had a strike or a spare and then it would blink and flash for everybody to see. Otherwise, it was just TN. So you just call Sarah TN from now on. We had a brilliant idea for the video, but we need to go and find something at Toys R Us or whatever is open. Goodwill just closed eight minutes ago. Damn it. That's really good for vlogging. So we found a bowling set, but we want something cheaper and we will find it. Hey, we can just take balls. That would work as well. And find some 
stuff. Like there's gotta be. There, yeah, I'm pretty sure there is. Maybe even set a solitary plastic bowling ball somewhere. Yes. We can take the bull set because we start with a game of bull first. <laughs> I found one, but it's expensive. Look what he found. <laughs> what are you pitching? Whoa, and there was left. Why can't I catch it? Oh my god. It's terrible. Is he saving? I don't know. Apple. I'm dead. I can't, I can't talk anymore. Dan's voice is yelling at me on a toy. <laughs> <gasps> marshmallow. What is oh yeah. Hey, where do I Can push the button it? for marshmallow? No, it doesn't and then you know someone else did From the same the thing. <gasps> there it is. I normally I'm not really a big fan of the Avengers and I, I mean I do like Iron Man just because of his douchey style, but Comic Con makes everything so well and so awesome. And even that is just a thing. But this is amazing. I will put the link in the description for you to watch the entire video. Basically, uh, at the Marvel thing yesterday, or somewhere yesterday, this happened. Look how far you've fallen. Lining up in the sweltering heat for hours. And that's all you're getting. Basically, someone makes an appearance and it's awesome. Of course, everyone loses their shit. That's why I love the whole geeky culture because I think nowadays actors do it more often that they actually play along with everything and they actually put the extra effort into like accepting the fact that they are a certain character and people love what they do as an actor as the character. I mean, it's a fact that Iron Man can no longer be played by anyone else other than Robert Downey Jr. because Robert Downey Jr. is an epic, epic, really well done character as Iron Man. If anyone knows anything other cool that happened at Comic-Con, please share it in the description or tweet it at us because I love seeing that stuff. Be sure to check out the link in the description. It is amazing. It is the best thing that I've seen in a long, long time of appearances that characters make. Also, Chris Hardwick, you show up everywhere nowadays. The fuck? We were debating about the word for half an hour. Apple, I, I understood Archer. So how did it? Apple Orchard. Orchard, so this is so amazing cool and you haven't seen the apple trees yet and they're awesome we have to there's some over that way but they're not tall yet no but they're they look weird for yeah. halloween they would be like perfect creepy. yeah because they chopped the top off yeah but that's good i think let's get some peaches or something Are they open yeah 9 to 7 p.m you that's like cool really <laughs> 10 minutes okay that's good let's get some peaches or something do you guys want something millions of peaches I wanted to film more because it's pretty awesome and uh, they have a festival in autumn, I think. Yes. Which is pretty cool. But the old lady running around, um, I was like, she's not looking, okay, I can film something. She didn't like you. She didn't like me at all. I don't know. She, she stopped us from walking towards the um, apple trees. So, I don't know. But uh, apparently we can come back and pick apples. All fall. All fall. So, we will come back and I hope you're as back at that time and uh, yeah, maybe we can film some stuff here or at least make some pictures. Come back, Yura, come back! Please, come back! I don't want to drive alone! <laughs> One year I just threw our pumpkins from Halloween at the side of the house and then they, they de decomposed kind of sort of because I was too lazy to take them to the garbage and now we have this. Wow. Is that the first year? This is like the third year, they won't stop coming back. Holy crap. You can see a couple of them over here. Yeah, we see the butts. How do you call them? The flower bits? Flowers. Flowers, really? Butts. Flower butts? This. Oh, there's already... Ah, wow. How huge are they going to get? Yeah, so we're gonna carve pumpkins. Where's the dog? Where, Where? is the doggy? No doggy? <sighs> Maybe if we eat the pie, we have some energy and could still do the, the fun Dutch, part. It's because it's a Dutch apple pie, we'll actually apple get pie. Euro's energy. You know that Dutch people are more relaxed, you know, don't know what's in there. But it's delicious. I hope so. But it's Dutch. Oh, no, no, no. Cut it. Yeah. Here, cut it. Oh, you don't want it full? No, no. Oh, go. go, go, go. Mommy, just cut it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
zombies. Oh, we can't Mama, I got Mama. Want? What do you want? You want pie? Yeah. <laughs> I seriously was running out of gas, so I got gas. I wanted to get it at an at an awesome number, but the only thing I can come up with was two five two five. So that's it. And I set up a camera here, my GoPro. I'm not sure if the angle is any good because I don't have an iPhone to check it and my display would have trained the camera too much. So I just set it up, but I think it even has a bit more wide angle, so it should have catched some good footage. I think right now we are at almost 500 pictures. Let's say I make 600, that would be about... Oh, it depends on how, mu how much I am using it to speed up. Oh, I'm not sure yet. I think I'm taking the camera now because it's dark. Wow, look at that. There is a animal on there. Ew. Hi. You're hungry. Oh my god, everything's empty. I'm so sorry. What do you want? You want? Yeah? How about this? Hmm? Yeah? Where's your, where's your buddy? Come! Ooh, you're licking my leg already. Okay. Actually, I can talk German to you. You probably only speak German, yeah? What's wrong with you? You already ate a whole tin. Stop it! There are two cats in the house. <laughs> Going crazy. It's like, oh, I haven't eaten in days and I don't know when there is more food coming. <sighs> okay, I'm leaving now. Bye! Bye. I've been on the internet too long. I even started noticing something else. It is starting to get light already. It is, it's becoming way too light early. So that's a good reason for me to end the vlog today because otherwise it is no longer a daily vlog and it's a two day vlog. So for me a good reason to end the vlog and say to you to have an awesome day. Depending on where you are, it might be morning, day or night. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye!